Today is day one of rolling out the COVID-19 vaccinations in the Brazos Valley. Dozens of healthcare workers were given the vaccine this morning. I was able to catch up with a familiar face around Brazos County, who is one of the first in the area to receive the vaccination. Encouraging and uplifting is how Dr. Seth Sullivan describes the first day of vaccinations. It's been such a year, uh, such a year of, of perseverance and of challenge. Dr. Sullivan, along with dozens of his colleagues at Baylor Scott and White Health and College Station, were the first to receive the doses of the vaccine Friday. It's a step forward. Baylor Scott and White have been preparing for the vaccination process for weeks. <laughs> Starting at 7.30 a.m. sharp, pharmacists were able to get more than 50 health care workers vaccinated. In total on the first day, 100 people have been vaccinated. Can you imagine nurses and doctors have been taking care of COVID-19 patients for months and they've sat down and several have tried to hold back the tears, but not the tears of sadness, the tear of joy. Dr. Sullivan says the process is just like getting a flu shot. After he and others got their first dosage, they had to wait around for 15 minutes to make sure there were no adverse effects. Fortunately, there were none. I feel great. I've got a little little soreness in the arm, which means that it work. It's working. Sullivan says he is overwhelmed by the amount of healthcare workers that volunteered to be in the first rounds of vaccines. He hopes it gives reassurance to the community that health experts believe in the vaccine and its safety. This is the step forward toward widespread vaccination, to herd immunity, and to uh, getting back to to the life that we all want, where we can be together. Uh, we can socially interact the way that we belong. Baylor Scott and White will continue to give out the vaccine to healthcare workers tomorrow and next week. Hospital leaders hope to get through the first week's allotment by Christmas.